My name is Mara Antonoff. I'm an assistant professor in thoracic and cardiovascular surgery at UT MD Anderson Cancer Center. I'm a member of the Annals Editorial Board and I have been so for approximately six months. In terms of trends that I see emerging in cardiothoracic surgery, I think um, a lot of the more recent publications revolve around the area of collaboration. We will see collaboration among institutions in the traditional sense, but I also think we're going to see a lot more collaboration in terms of scientists and clinicians looking at biologic data and using that to look at subsequent surgical outcomes. I think there are a wide variety of reasons that manuscripts may receive unfavorable reviews, but I think that the elements that authors really need to be wary of are those that they can't correct after the fact. The types of unfavorable reviews that have to do with the methodology are a real problem. So it's important for authors to really consider using appropriate methodology for the study question that they aim to answer before they embark upon that study. Those are the types of things that are really difficult to correct. In addition, if authors are trying to answer a question that's already been answered or a question that's really not of relevance to the audience, it also becomes problematic. That really can't be fixed after the fact. Other issues such as um, the type of writing or streamlining the actual manuscript itself, that can be fixed down the road. But it's important for authors to recognize the importance of the question that they're answering, whether there's a true gap in the knowledge, and whether their study is appropriately designed to answer that question. There are a number of rewards in being a healthcare provider, and I feel that we're very fortunate in th as being thoracic surgeons in that we're allowed to deliver news to families and patients at a variety of key points in their lives. Um, unlike providers who take care of patients in a chronic manner, which is also very important, we have the privilege of being able to tell people that they've gone through an operation successfully or that they are cancer free. And these are the types of news that family members really rejoice upon hearing. And I, I personally really enjoy that aspect of, of my job. One of the things that I really enjoy is traveling the world, and I've had the opportunity to do so with my husband. I enjoy seeing different parts of the world, enjoying different culture, trying different foods, and I also really enjoy my children. I'm very lucky to have uh, three very healthy children, but I haven't been able to combine those two interests. And so one of the things I really look forward to doing is being able to travel the world with my children and expose them to some of the cultural elements that I've been able to enjoy in my life.